Good evening and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews with me, Dave the Beer Dad, back again to do another beer review. I was just checking the time to make sure it was evening. It certainly is. It's early evening. England have just beaten Australia in the cricket. Happy days. Right, back to do another beer review. This is a wild beer I've not seen around anywhere that I've been lately. There have been a fair few places to be fair. And this is Wylam Hickey the Reef. And this is a uh, Lemonata Pale, that's what it says on the front. It weighs in at 4.2% ABV, it says so there. And the best before on this one is the first, the first 20, it says so in very faint uh, numbers there. Nice can, top out with a rat in it, uh, and a skull. Same on that side. Don't know what the references is. If you do, please let me know. Because usually there's a reference to, to what they have up there. Can art. So, while I'm, love them, love them, love them, love them. Just outside Newcastle. Um, this got is hopped with Chinook BBC and Mosaic BBC. Um, and that is pretty much it. Brewing in Canada, UK. While I'm brewing Newcastle upon Tyne, UK. And the can art is done by realize.co.uk. There you go. So that's all the beef, all the beef guff out the way. Let's crack it open. Let's put this beer through its pieces. In fact, I'm going to use this glass. I have three on the go. Um, I have this one, the brew dog little uh, scooter. Actually, I have four on the go, really. This one, the brew dog scooter. Or mini scooter, the beaver tail pint glass, and the um, overworks glass. So, just do this one. Beer glass, what we've got, we've got a, ourselves a bright yellow straw gold coloured beer, light gold coloured beer, slightly hazy. Nice start. Two fingers, finger three quarters, bright, does white head. Looks fabulous, absolutely fabulous. Let's get a nose so I can smell. Oh, lemons, fresh, juicy, squeezed lemon. Oh, that smells. That smells beautiful. There's not much else. Oh, this is not going to be a tart beer, to be fair, because that's what it smells like. It smells like it's going to be tart, it's going to be a bit sour. Let's go for the carb of the body. Light, light body, light carb, really good, really nice on the palate. Let's go for a big gobble. Hits a lemon and not much else, if I'm being honest. It's like a little bit of lemon peel. Um, and that's probably about it. There's not a massive amount going on, if I'm being honest with you. In fact, if anything, it's a little bit watery and it's a little bit washed out. Smells better than it tastes, which is unusual for a while of beer. And to be fair, I'm a little bit disappointed. <coughs> it's not good, which is a shame. It is so lackluster. It smells better than it looks. It smells better than it tastes. It cost me that much. For Barton's, this will be the father law to celebrate the cricket. It's not, oh. not fabulous. <laughs> right. What? That's not good. I don't like that at all. It's really, really, really. Oh, there's no flavour to it. it smells good. It tastes rubbish. So, Wylam's Hickey the Reek. Uh, Lemonato Pale. Do I like it? No. Would I buy it again? No. Would I recommend it to friends? No. It's the first wild and beer that I do not like. It's sad. Sad times. It's just 
got no body to it, it just washes itself out. It's rubbish. So, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Put a comment below, please. Link to also to the Lionel Brewery, also below. <coughs> if you've the video, do that. Don't let the video, do that. If you've had it, let me know what you think, as I say. And I'll see you in the next one. Hey, Leo.